everybody this is miss friend and welcome to another video class in today's story time i am bringing you the incredible story of the cautious caterpillar in here you will be able to see and witness uh, the becoming of a butterfly okay shall we start great i'm going to press here Let's go. The cautious caterpillar. It was springtime in the garden. Can you see the garden? Cody the caterpillar hatched from her egg and crawled into a big green leaf. She smiled happily. I love being a caterpillar, she said and began to eat her tasty leaf. Just then a lady a ladybird flew over it. You are very lucky, said the ladybird. When you become a butterfly, you have wings like me. Can you see the ladybird's uh, wings? Flying looks very tiring, said Cody. I wish you could stay a caterpillar forever. Oh no, let's see why Cody thinks that. Don't worry, said the ladybird. Having wings is great. You can always stop for a rest. Cody smiled, but didn't feel sure. Maybe one day, she said. She carried on eating, and the ladybird flew away. Bye-bye, ladybird. The next day, a bee buzzed on over. You are very lucky, said the bee. When you become a butterfly, you will sip nectar like me. I don't think I will like nectar, said Cody. I wish I could stay a caterpillar forever. Oh, poor, poor Cody. Don't worry, said the bee. Drinking nectar is great. It's ever so yummy. Cody smiled but didn't feel sure. Maybe one day, she said. She carried on eating and the bee buzzed away. Bye-bye, bee. A few days later, a grasshopper jumped on over. You are very lucky, said the grasshopper. When you become a butterfly, you will have six legs like me. Can you see the legs? One, two, three, four, five, six. But I like having 16 legs, said Cody. I wish I could stay a caterpillar forever. Don't worry, said the grasshopper. Having six legs is great. That's plenty for landing on the ground. Cody smiled but didn't feel sure. Maybe one day, she said. And then she carried on eating and the grasshopper jumped away. Bye bye, grasshopper. The next day, Cody was full. She thought about everything her friends had told her and decided to be brave. She imagined herself like a ladybird like the bee <gasps> and the grasshopper wow maybe today she said as she changed herself into a chrysalis she stayed like that for many many days until she was finally ready to leave and become a butterfly can you see her over here it's beautiful! Cody exploded the garden, feeling happy and proud of her new wings. Having wings is great, she said as she flew past the ladybird. This is yummy, she said to the bee as they sipped nectar together. Can you see them right here? Wow, six legs is plenty, said Cody as she landed next to the grasshopper. That evening, she came across a caterpillar eating a tasty green leaf. Can you see the new caterpillar over here? You are very lucky, said Cody. When you finish eating, you will become a butterfly like me. The caterpillar smiled but didn't look sure. I wish I could stay a caterpillar forever, he said. Don't worry, said Cody. I love being a caterpillar too, but trust me, being a butterfly is great. 
and that's the end i do hope that you like this story this story was full of bugs it was the caterpillar it was the grasshopper the ladybug and finally the butterfly Cody, the caterpillar, became a beautiful, beautiful butterfly. Do you remember when we started yesterday the life cycle? It happened everything from the little egg to the caterpillar to the cocoon until the butterfly. I hope that you like this story and see you in the next class.